About 300,000 people in West Virginia who can't use their water are now being told they could have it back soon. Officials say tests show the amount of a coal processing chemical that spilled into the Elk River last week has dropped below toxic levels. Sometimes it doesn't show up at all. Still, West Virginia's governor is urging anxious citizens to be patient. It is still a state of emergency. Things are looking uh, right. They're trending in the right direction. Please don't jump ahead. Some restaurants started to open again Sunday, but customers and owners alike say things are far from normal. They can eat, they can drink, they can't eat with real silverware or on real plates or out of a real glass, but at this point, I hope everyone's just happy. <laughs> we're just coming back through trying to get some to eat. From North Carolina. From North Carolina. Come, from Come North home. Carolina. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what's going on here? State health officials say so far, only 10 people who were exposed to the contaminated water have been admitted to the hospital. None were in serious condition. Matt Small, the Associated Press.